guys good morning this is alex welcome to our channel here at eos marketplace news um guys for today i will be giving the latest um update for the crypto in the crypto world rather so i will be giving you the price analysis as of november 23 for the top 10 cryptocurrency all right top 10 i'm sure that you are um really eager to know what are the status of the top 10 cryptocurrency or tokens okay so um this won't take long just sit back and relax i will take care of you all right so guys here this news is brought to us by pcn or preferred currency dot news bitcoin ripple ethereum stellar eos litecoin cardano monero tron and dash so this is the price analysis for november 23 update so does a crash in prices indicate the decaying fundamentals of an asset class in many instances it does but the market usually gets the fundamentals of an emerging technology wrong both in the short term and in the long term in may 1997 amazon share price was quoting at 18 dollars short-term expectations propelled uh, propelled it, it to $300 by December 1998 and from there it slumped to $6 per share after the dot-com bubble burst at that point the market was severely underestimating its potential and the non-believers were claiming victory however the model proved everyone wrong and Amazon became the second company in the history to reach a market capitalization of one trillion dollars so blockchain entrepreneur and industry advisor Vinny Lingham said to coin telegraph the climate can change once uh, once more companies with solid um, use cases emerge from their development cycles gain traction and prove sound business value to make a difference just because the prices have crashed it doesn't signal the end of an asset class precisely as the price action in the near term is dictated by technicals let's look at the charts and forecast the probable price action okay let's start so first up BTC and USD during a waterfall decline support levels are not honored making it difficult to predict the bottom the pullbacks also usually last only for about one to three days Bitcoin attempted a recovery on November 21 that failed at four thousand seven hundred ninety nine point seventy four dollars subsequently the BTC and USD pair has resumed its downtrend making a new low both the moving averages are sloping down and the RSI is deep in the oversold territory this shows that the sellers are in command the immediate support on the downside is four thousand one hundred dollars below which the fall can extend to three thousand five hundred to three thousand dollars any recovery attempt will face a stiff resistance at the downtrend line and five thousand dollars so though we want to use the current fall to buy we believe that the trader should wait for a level to hold it before initiating any long positions all right guys so take note for btc and usd pair um the traders should wait for a level to hold before initiate initiating and a long position so be careful next xrp and usd ripple has broken down on the uptrend line which shows that it is also being affected by negative sentiment however it remains well above its lows which confirms its out um, outperformance the moving averages have started to turn down and the rsi has dipped below 40 which suggests that the supply is outpacing demand the next support on the downside is 0 0.37185 dollars and below that uh, 0 0.26913 dollars so the xrp and usd pair will point to a consolidation if the prices quickly scale above the uptrend line and the moving averages flatten out for now it is best to stay on the sidelines all right third eth and usd 
Ethereum is not finding buyers at higher levels. The pullback stalled at $141.91, which shows a lack of buying support. Currently, the bears are attempting to extend the decline to the next support level at $110. Though anything is possible in the markets, we believe that the oversold levels on the RSI point to a probable pullback. We do not recommend trading on hope. Hence, we shall wait for a new buy setup for, for, uh, to form <clears throat> before suggesting any trade in it. On the upside, the ETH and USD pair will face a stiff hurdle at $167.32. So the 20-day EMA is also close to this level, making it a critical resistance to cross for the bulls. Good luck! Next, XLM and USD. Stellar is at a critical level. If the bear sustain prices below $0.184, it will be negative and can result into the start of a new down move. Um, the lower levels to watch on the downside are $0.154788. That is the intraday low of March 18 and Mar yeah, March 18 and $0.138565 which is the intraday low hit on December 22 of last year. Now, conversely, if the bulls w um, if the bull successfully defend the 0 0.184 level, the XLM and USD pair might pull back to the 20-day EMA and above it to the downtrend uh, downtrend line. We suggest traders wait Okay, we suggest traders wait for a new buy setup to form before entering any long positions. Okay, next, my favorite token, EOS and USD. So though EOS has broken down of the critical support at $3.8723, it has not plunged. So this shows some buying support at lower levels. The oversold reading on the RSI also points to a recovery attempt. Now, if the bull scales um, $3.8723, a move to the downtrend line and above it to $4.493 is probable. The 20-day EMA is also located close to this level. Hence, um, $4.493 oh, $4 will act as a major roadblock. So if the EOS and USD pair falls to rise above um, three rather three point eight seven to three dollars, it can slump to three dollars. So we do not find any bullish patterns developing, hence we are not proposing a trade in it. <coughs> All right. Next, LTC and USD. The bulls have been attempting to hold the support at thirty-two dollars for the past three days, but have not been able to push Litecoin higher. So still the oversold levels on the RSI point to a probable pullback. On the upside, the LTC and USD pair <coughs> will face a stiff resistance at the 20-day EMA and above that at the 47.246 to 49.466 dollar zone. On the other hand, <coughs> if the bears sink prices below the support zone of 32 to 29.653 dollars the fall can extend to the next support at 20 dollars next ada and usd the pullback in cardano could not scale the 0.05 dollar level and the price is back at the support of 0.041 dollars if the ada and usd pair breaks down and sustains below 0.041 dollars it can slide to the next lower target of $0.025954. So on the other hand, if the bulls succeed in rebounding from close to current levels, the digital currency will again attempt to break out of $0.05. If successful, the pullback can extend to $0.060105, which is likely to act a major resistance because this is the previous support and the 20-day EMA is also close to this level. Okay, so guys, be careful. Okay, be careful if you... In trading in or investing on something so next XMR and USD 
Um, though the Bulls attempted a pullback in More uh, Monero on November 21 and 22, they could not push prices above $72. As a result, the price turned down once again. And this, um, in this down leg, if the XMR and USD pair plunges below $60, the fall can extend to the next support at $46. <laughs> Excuse me. If the virtual currency finds buyers at the current levels, the bulls will again attempt to break out of the $72 level. If this level is crossed, the pullback can continue to next overhead resistance of $81. Next is the TRX and USD. Tron could not scale above the previous support turned resistance of $0.0158.7681 in the past two days. However, a small positive is that the bulls have held prices above the November 20 intraday low of $0.0122194. So we anticipate the bulls to make another attempt to climb above 0.0158. 7681 and reach the next resistance of 0 0.0183 dollars however contrary to our expectation if the trx and usd pair plummets below 0 0.0122194 dollars the fall can extend to the next lower level of 0 0.0084449 dollars Okay, so guys, last but not the least, Dash and USD. Dash continues to trade near the support of the descending channel. This shows that sellers have the upper hand. Any breakdown of the channel will be a negative development that can push the Dash and USD pair to the next support at $75. If the support of the channel holds, the bulls will attempt another pullback to scale $120 levels and reach the next overhead resistance of 129.58 dollars we believe that the trader should wait for a trend reversal before initiating any long positions <clears throat> all right so um guys that's it for the price analysis of the top 10 cryptocurrencies all right so for more updates please visit preferredcurrency.news and subscribe now. If you subscribe, you will be the first one to get notified of the new updates. Um, you can use your preferred method. You can use PayPal for monthly recurring. That's only $15 per month fiat. Or you can use the Coinbase, op Coinbase option for $180 annual subscription. That's to be paid with your favorite crypto. All right, so guys, you can contact us directly if you have concerns, questions, or anything that you would like to um, say to us. Your name and email is required, and of course, your message and just sit uh, head sent. So, um, if you like, and I'm sure you will, you can talk or you can contact directly the man behind Preferred Currency News. <coughs> His name is Donald Lewis or Donald the Guru. You can call his number at 1801-601-8105. WhatsApp at 1801-471-6939. You can add him on Skype, Donald.fcda. You can follow him on Twitter at Preferred Crypto telegram channel you can join our telegram channel which is preferred crypto dot news and telegram um you can send a message on telegram to donald lewis that's at preferred crypto all right so guys if you become one of our subscribers you will have the chance to become one of the affiliates so how you can just hit this link right here and then it will take you to the page where it says how all right okay now guys as promised i will be giving you a glimpse of what our subscribers are getting and if you subscribe yes for the future subscribers as well now it's just a glimpse all right so that you will have an idea um what will i be getting if i subscribe to preferred currency news all right here when you subscribe to Preferred Currency News, we will be notifying you every day, 12 hours before we post videos here on YouTube. And that's via email, all right? 
So this is the newsletter that we will be sending. Now here are the available, uh, available articles and news of the day. Okay, and if you like to read other news, the previous news, no worries because it's available also here. You can um, you can just click one of these months right there, here, here, and you can choose what news you want to read. All right, so guys, let me introduce to you the Donald's research list. Okay, Donald's research list cannot, okay, can cannot be found anywhere else on the internet, but only here at Preferred Currency News. So why is it really important? Let me show you. Here, <clears throat> this is the Donald's research list. It is a complete list of tokens and coins and their status. And it is updated every day. Imagine how, how your life will be more convenient, right? You don't need to research um, or open a lot of websites for you to check what are the um, status of the coin because um, Donald is really, uh, you know, um, Donald gives importance that you need to keep track of the status of the tokens and coins. Now, let me show you an example. Okay, for the first column right here, these are the names of the tokens and coins. Yes, guys, it's complete. Okay, now let me show you. Maybe you're wondering, why are there um, colors? Um, when you see a red color, it means negative news. Orange and tan are neutral. Yellow are fair. Green have good news. Blue are showing the best news. Okay, so when you subscribe to PreferredCurrency.News, you can have a copy of Donald's research list every day. So that you can, you know, you can compare it to the previous previous status of the coin. If you can trace if it is really going well or not, right? Okay, <clears throat> first up, let's not go far. Bitcoin is showing the best news as of November 24, 2018. So let's start. Um, for Bitcoin's um, recent price, it's 4,279.31422238. Share of total market volume, it's 0 0.32868963. 45% for Google searches compared to the past seven days. It's crossing up 50 for SMA movement. Um, number of technical, number of positive technical indicators too. 24 hours volume versus price is zero. Seven days volume versus price is 0 0.71. And 30 days volume versus price, it's 1.47. And percent issued, it's 82.81%. All right, so <clears throat> guys, if you like, you can, um, for example, or where is the um, the token that I want to check? Okay, instead of scrolling in and scrolling up, you can just simply control F, all right, control F, and then type down the name of the token or coin that you want to check. For example, let's check EOS. Okay, so for ES as of November 24, 2018, ES is also showing the best news. So use your recent price, it's 3.53721354. Share of total market volume, it's 0 0.06077625. Um, Google searches compared to the past seven days, it's 100%. Um, it's crossing up 50 for SMA movement, number of positive technical indicators, three, 24 hours volume versus price, it's 4.45, seven days volume versus price, it's 0 0.87, 30 days volume versus price, it's 3.89, and percent issued, it's 90.06%, all right, so guys, that easy, very understandable, and how you would, um, how you would check, and how would you read the data? Um, but 
um, just to inform everyone, this sheet is not a recommendation to buy or sell. Okay, we highly recommend that you do your own research. You research each token, and then you um, you decide afterwards. Right? Okay. So, um, guys, maybe okay in doing your research, when you see the coins here that has a lot of green and blue in their status or role you might want to prioritize them in doing your research because it's really showing a good status like for example eos there's a green 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 and then it's also showing the best news so meaning it's a good token to research to but all right again we are not financial advisors so we are highly recommending everyone that you do your own research and then you can decide afterwards all right so guys that's it for today that's the most um that's the latest update in the cryptocurrency world so <clears throat> if you'd like to have more updates and for more information please visit preferredcurrency.news and you can send a message you can contact donald or you can leave a comment down below in the comment section all right maybe you have su some suggestions or any questions feel free all right so that's it for today please don't forget to hit that like button subscribe and i hope to see you again thank you so much for joining me in this video this has been alex once again now signing off. Bye.